welcome back or welcome to my channel. So today, I'm gonna be showing y'all how I get this cotton candy pink color and how I installed this bob from Nadua Hair on Amazon. Um, first, I wanna thank Nadua Hair on Amazon for sponsoring this video. It's my first sponsored video. But um, yeah, thank y'all so much for sponsoring this video. This is my first time um, wearing a bob wig and I've been wanting to do this style for a while and this color so i finally got to do it and it was like the perfect time when they hit me up about doing the video so um yeah not do it here on amazon not just like the regular not do it here it's not do it here on amazon specifically on amazon so yeah i'm going to show y'all how i got this color and then i'm going to show y'all how i installed it and then we'll get into the review portion and yeah as always if you want to see how i achieve this look this color this install then keep on watching All right, so when you saw me installing the wig, you can see that the color is a little bit different than it was after the watercolor portion of the video. Oh my God, it's raining. If y'all can hear the rain, sorry. But um, as y'all can see, the color was a little bit more vibrant of a pink when I finished uh, watercoloring it. Like when I was doing it, I dipped the hair to like test it. And then I was looking at it and I was like, mm. It needs to be a little bit darker, but it really was just me. Like I just could not, I guess it was just the lighting in here that I could not see that the color was actually taking cause the color was so light. Yeah, so I added two whole bottles of the cotton candy dye from Adore and when I was supposed to add one in the first place, but I literally could not see the, why is it raining so hard? Yeah, I just didn't think the color was taken, so I kept adding more and more dye. Ended up using both bottles, and I was only supposed to use one in the first place. Like, I already knew coming into this that I was only supposed to use one bottle, but I literally could not see the color showing up. So I fixed it. I just put like bleach all over the hair. Not for long, just a little bit, just for it to lighten it to this shade, but I just needed to lighten it up a little bit because I didn't want it that vibrant like i don't want it that vibrant moral of the story if you want this exact color use one bottle it's gonna show up okay i just can't see so yeah one bottle of the adore cotton candy hair dye to get this exact color so do all the same steps that i did just put one bottle okay now let's get into this review again this hair is from i do a hair on amazon and i filmed the unboxing for y'all of course so i'm gonna place that clip over this while i talk so this is what the box looked like from Nadua hair 
Um, it's black, it's got Nadula and gold. It says natural, durable, luxurious on the box. Yeah, really cute box, a little gold writing. So we open up the box and the first thing on top is the wig. And it's in a hairnet, of course, and inside of a plastic bag. Then up underneath, they put in some lashes, two of the new color wig caps, and a little thank you card, and it's also got their social media and their website, email, WhatsApp, phone number, all that on the card. So yeah, that's all that was in the box. Now, let's get into these details. So, the wig I got was a 613 Bob wig. It's a 13 by six lace front wig, 150% density, pre-plucked, and I got it in eight inches. I did pluck the hairline just a little bit. I really didn't pluck that much. I think the density is fine on it for a Bob. I mean, how thick do you want it? Like, I think this is, I think this is great, like, I think this density is fine. Like usually I um I get like 180 and up density wigs, but for a bob, I think this is like a perfect density 150. As for the construction, it's two combs in the front, comb in the back, adjustable strap, 13 by six, lace frontal. I didn't pick uh I don't know what the size is, like the cap size. I didn't pick a size, it just this is the size that it comes. But I have a big head and I had room to get in this, so um I guess I could say it's big head friendly because I have a huge head and I didn't struggle at all to get this wig on. That's one thing I can say about Amazon wigs. I've done an Amazon wig review before. I'll put that video here. And also my detail install video because I did speed up the install because as I always say in my install videos after my detail install video that I'm just gonna speed it up in the future because I already have a whole detailed video on it. So there's no point in me going through all that. So if you wanna see, all the details, all the products, you know, all the specific steps, then y'all can check out that video here. But um, yeah, that's one thing I have noticed about Amazon wigs. I've only done two, well, this is my second one, but um, I never have an issue getting them on. Like, even though you can't pick your cap size, um, I never have an issue getting them on my head. Like, there's been enough room to get my head which is huge, and my hair, which is really thick, up under here. I didn't struggle at all to get this on. Yeah, the hair is like super good quality and like soft, like I love this. I thought I was gonna look so stupid in a bob, and this color, cause like I've never done a color like this before, and I've never worn a bob before, like I'm used to wearing long hair. So I thought I was gonna look super, I thought I was gonna look stupid, y'all. I thought I was gonna look dumb. I actually look really cute. I like the way it turned out. Like I really like this wig, and I'm definitely getting another one and like doing different colors. I think I look really cute in a bob. I feel like classy. Yeah, the hair is super soft um, for shedding. It didn't shed like combing it. When I first took out the box, it didn't shed. Of course it did shed after I colored it and bleached it, which is expected. I mean, that's processing the hair, so it probably get some shedding anyway. But I did get shedding after that. But as far as like walking around, sitting here, I don't have hair just like falling out or shedding. When I do comb it, I like to get ready and style it and stuff. I get like a few strands, but nothing major two or three strands but um yeah shedding's not a problem with this wig the density is great hair texture is really soft it's just bomb like all the way around like i'm really i like these amazon wigs like i'm really liking these amazon wigs like like they've been better than some of these other companies and a lot of people wouldn't expect that being that it's amazon but like they got some good stuff and for a good price like i need to get on there don't don't think that you gotta spend a whole lot of money on a wig and think oh it's gonna be fine also don't think just because it looks good on somebody else it's gonna look good when you do it because it's all about how you install like, the hair can be bomb but if your install ain't right then it's gonna look trash like it's gonna look trash yeah i really like i really like this i really like the cut like the cut is even um i like this length i wanted this length for a bob like short like right above my shoulders i started to go with a 10 inch when um, i was picking out which wig i wanted when they hit me up but i think 10 inch would have been like right here and i kind of like it i like it at an 8 inch i like it at this length yeah it took the color really well i don't even have no complaints about this wig i'm trying to think if it was any mm -mm. I didn't have no trouble with the lace. Usually the issues, like the only issues I really ever have with hair I get is it not fitting my head or like the lace isn't long enough or like something's wrong where I can't get the lace to do right. Like at the ear tabs or like come off. Like, you know, I always have problems with the wig fitting or like the lace or something, but didn't have that problem with this. It fit perfectly fine. Like I didn't struggle at all. I wasn't snatching at it. Like I've done in the past with some wigs. Um, I wasn't snatching at it to get it on. Like you just went on on my head, no tugging or nothing. The lace melted really good into my skin. 
skin, not having any trouble with lifting or anything. But that's really has to do with the install. And taking care of it at night. Wrap your lace up, your edges up at night. Tie it down. Don't just go to bed. That's how your installs last. You tie it down at night. Take care of it. Just because you have weed don't mean that you can just neglect it. Okay, you have to take care of it. Yeah, I'm trying to think. Is there anything else I need to go through about this weed? I just, I just love this. Like, I love this vibe on me. I love this color on me. I love this color on my skin. Density's fine. Took color fine. Doesn't shed that much. Didn't struggle to get it on my head. Big head friendly. Yeah, I mean, I don't really know what else to say. But I'm gonna start getting my wigs on Amazon more often because it's more, they just seem to be up there to me, like, I only gotten two wigs from Amazon before, but like, I just hate like having like fight with wigs to get it on my head and I haven't had that problem getting my wigs off Amazon yet. Yeah, I think that's, I think that's all I have to say about this wig. So stay tuned for future videos cause I'm definitely, I'm definitely gonna be wearing bobs more often and I'm definitely gonna go try more colors cause I think this turned out super cute and I just like, I just love this. Like I don't have any complaints about it yeah that's all i have to say again i got this wig from nadula hair on amazon um and y'all can follow their instagram at nadula hair underscore amazon i put all that in the description everything about the company will be in the description below all the details will be listed below um the link will be below and yeah make sure you follow my social medias i'm gonna take some pictures i want to take some pictures today in this week because i had an outfit that i wanted to wear with this hair but it's raining and it's really ugly outside today but I might take them inside, but we'll see. But if y'all want to see those pictures, then make sure you follow me on my social media. That will be in the description as well. And it's also in my outro at the end of the video. So make sure you follow me on my social media. Make sure y'all go to Nadula Hair on Amazon and get y'all some wigs. So we can be out here looking bomb all 2020. Again, thank you to Nadula Hair for sponsoring this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel, please. And thank you. Oh, and also, um, y'all comment below what kind of videos y'all want to see from me. I mean, obviously, I do like beauty-based videos. I do hair, makeup, clothing hauls. Like, what companies y'all want to see clothing hauls from or whatever. I do have an AliExpress haul. And I want to do a Shein haul in the future sometime. But, uh, yeah, y'all comment some stuff below. I never say that in my videos, but y'all comment some stuff that y'all want to see. Um, I also do, like, I want to do challenges and stuff. I do vlogs. Um, I might do some DIYs because I'm very crafty. Fun fact, okay. But yeah, just let me know what y'all wanna see. Make sure you have your post notifications on so you don't ever miss when I post because you don't wanna do that. You don't wanna do that. So make sure your post notifications are on and I will see y'all in my next video. Bye.